and now an arcade classic that helped launch an entire franchise and put Nintendo on the map. The reason I'm able to continue this work, I mean, it all started with Donkey Kong. At number 15, it's the 800-pound gorilla of video games, Donkey Kong. Anything that involves like a plumber and a big gorilla, what's more fun than that? The now legendary Donkey Kong first hit arcades in 1981. This addictive platformer featured Mario in his first ever video game appearance as he attempted to rescue his girlfriend from the barrel-throwing ape. No, I don't think Princess Peach getting kidnapped is funny at all. I think that's serious business, and uh, you've got to take it seriously as a gamer. If you don't, you know, you're just kind of leaving her to die at the hands of whatever Dark Lord or the monkey or the gorilla or whatever. I need a person who looks like a monkey running away from barrels after bigger monkey who has stolen girl. A giant grill just took this girl I want to ask out. He climbed the top of this building I've been trying to build that's been a pain, and now he's throwing barrels that somehow hit that oil barrel that's on fire, and now they're, they're fire barrels that somehow go up ladders. He's like, oh, <laughs> barrels. He throws the barrels, and it just perfectly, so he does a little spin. <laughs> There was the one that had the wee, boink, 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 wee, you know, it had the weird elevators and then the thing droppings. If you actually make it all the way up to the top, you think, yay, I'm gonna rescue the princess. No, he comes and he takes the princess to the next level. Like, that's not an easy game. Like, it, it, you have to put some serious time in and then you go right back to the beginning if you lose. That's pretty frustrating. All frustration aside, Donkey Kong remains a singular piece of gaming history, as countless spin-offs, sequels, and imitators prove. Nintendo wouldn't be as huge as it was if it wasn't for the original Donkey Kong.